Hey guys, this is Matt Goulet from Pete's RV Center in South Burlington, Vermont, and today I'm outside the Cougar 21 RBS, and I just want to do a quick walk around for you, show you why these Cougars have been one of the best-selling travel trailers here to date. Um, so the 21 RBS is going to be a nice lightweight model, good for any couple or any small family, and I'll show you the sleeping capacity when we get inside of this thing. Um, but we'll start right up front here. So it's going to come with a power tongue jack on the front, so click of a button, easy, um, up and down. You're also going to see that comes with a light if you're going to be hooking and unhooking at night. Twin propane tanks as well on the front of this guy, um, as well as a spot for two batteries and two battery boxes. Now I just want to touch on the construction here. So it's going to come with a full fiberglass front cap which is going to be accented by LED lights um, in it as well. And you're going to see that cap's going to be wrapped around about three inches or so on the coach. So that seam's not going to be right on the edge of the camper. That's going to help you out in the long run because it's going to help prevent water damage. You're going to see they use the same concept on the roof on this one as well. So that one piece rubber roof that extends the full length of the camper is, is going to be wrapped three inches over the side. You're also going to see it's going to have a gutter system on there as well to direct the water off, off the side of the camper. We'll take a peek at the pass-through storage. So this pass-through storage is going to um, have vinyl flooring in it as well. So the one piece that extends all the way through the coach is going to be part of the it's going to be part of the pass-through storage, which is nice because then it allows you to put wet stuff in there and not and it won't harm your camper um, at all, um, opposed to the carpet material that some other companies use. <clears throat> so like I mentioned, fully aluminum framed. Um, this will have the power awning on it as well. It will have the outdoor speakers, which are two nice upgrades. So if you do want to listen to music on a nice day like today, you can do so in the shade um, from that awning. So these are going to use the bigger wheels on as well. These Cougars, they're going to have 15-inch wheels opposed to the industry standard 14. Just going to give you a little bit smoother of a ride going down the road. If you're going to be on the rocky roads um, or the dirt roads, it's going to be a little bit nicer for you. Just give you a little bit more comfortable of a tow as well as be a little bit safer. And we're going to see as we go into the camper here, nice grab handle, easy to get in and out of this coach. Um, just gives you a little bit more stability with a three-step entrance as well. I'll give you a full shot here. The coach. So we'll start over on the dinette. So this is going to be a nice U-shaped dinette. That table can be pulled out too. It's not going to be one that's going to be fixed into the ground. So if you don't want it there, you can get rid of it very easily. Or if you need a little bit more room on one side of the table, you can do so and you can adjust it. Um, that will turn into another sleeping space as well, um, which is nice. So if you will have company, a uh, spot for them to sleep there. And you're going to have windows on all sides of the slide out, which will all open to give you that nice cross ventilation in this camper. Up here in the master, um, bedroom portion of the camper you're going to have a nice divider which is going to be a curtain if you want a little bit more privacy um, you're also going to have a lot of storage all the way around the bed um, as well as a nice charging station for your smartphone um, or iPod or iPad um, with outlets on both sides and as I touched on the construction on the outside I want to do on the inside as well it's going to use more of a crown roof system a um, couple benefits to that. So being up in the northeast, it's going to give you a little bit easier snow and water runoff um, and during the winter time. Also, it's going to allow for a little bit more spacious feel on the inside of the coach. It is the new style that a lot of companies are going with. Stainless steel appliances in, in the kitchen. You're going to have the nice two bowl sink here. Um, you're going to have the nice stainless steel microwave, stainless steel stove. And you're also going to see tons of storage all the way around here. That's going to be raised panel cabinetry storage. Um, those are going to be nice, nice residential grab handles as well. And this will have the 8 cubic foot refrigerator on to post the industry standard 6. So there will be an upgrade there as well. Um, storage on this side. And then we'll peek into, the, peek into the bathroom here quickly. So nice glass shower surround shower here. Skylight above. You're also going to see there's going to be a nice medicine cabinet and sink. And you're going to have a toilet. They use, they, they use their space very, very well. Um, in these Cougars and they, they're able to put um, a lot of features in something that's going to be 21 feet of living space. But again, my name is Matt Goulet. I work at Pete's RV Center, South Burlington, Vermont. Um, we stock over a thousand units a year and we can, get, we can get you the best price on any camper. So before you go and purchase a camper, definitely try out Pete's RV Center. Ask us for a quote and we hope to see you at one of our dealerships soon. Thanks.